real tight, and you, in fact, your defense buckled down and only allowed five points in that quarter. What was the key behind that uh, defensive stand? It was game planning. I mean, we as coaches say, hey, who we're going to have in a defense at moments, who we're going to have an offense at moments, something we haven't done all year. We kind of just trust the guys in, in the fact, but now we're like, hey, we got to really know what we're doing and who we're putting in the game and what situations. And us implementing Dallin in at the end, he was able to close out on the shooters. And we, we had a lot of quick guys there at the end, which it propelled because if I throw, you know, if I was offensive minded when the game's tight, then I, I believe we, we lose that game. It seemed though it took a while for you guys to get started in the game. It seemed to be a little slow at the beginning, but the momentum picked up. Well, it's, ten, it's 10 o'clock in the morning. I, I mean, know it's 10 o'clock in the morning. I right? mean, that's, that, I mean, think about it. We play all, all year at 7. They have us at 8 last, last week, and they got us at 10 again. I mean, the boys are still waking up. So for me, I just, I'm just proud of they, they showed up this morning. I keep on saying tonight because I feel that way. But, you know, they, they, sh they showed heart and character today. Well, the town came out to support you tonight, today. Oh, yeah. It's, I just told somebody, you know, it's, it's the best thing for Bremerton because Bremerton is built on basketball. You know, that's, that every, everywhere you go when I was a kid, basketball was, bou balls are bouncing everywhere. And for the community to come out like that and support and then the boys put on the show, it just there's more to come. That's well, you I'm think excited. the Bremerton crowd had an effect upon the end of the game? Oh, yeah. I, I told uh, before the game, I, I told my Coach Joe, I was like, hey, we got the advantage. We got the crowd. So I, 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 I was believing that that down the stretch that was going to be a, a huge factor. So, so now you're going to Yakima. How's that feel to get back to state after what, 2010? Or 2004? It's well, emotional. So yeah, it was Jarrell Flora and um, yeah. and Andre. Yeah, in the, in the locker room we were a little emotional because you now I missed my Hall of Fame weekend. We got I got inducted. Our team got inducted, so I had to miss that for this game. And. Well, you know, you got to sacrifice, Coach. Yeah, that's life. <laughs> well, hey, a good win today, and I know your boys are. It's going to be. Waiting here to celebrate. Going to be a great ride home, isn't it? Yes, sir. So, well, we'll we'll see you next week. All right, thank you.